Oh, is that me trying to get too close to the edge of the world? It might. The oaks. Oh, man. This whole thing is freaking out. The whole city's melting away and revealing some other city. Some other time? What is going on, Geeks? Unite the Clans here. Back in your life with some Californium. This is episode two. I hope you checked out episode one. If not, I'll make it the first card available in this video so you can link quickly to it. We're in the office of our boss. We lost our apartment across the street and be, by being evicted by the old lady, and now we've been fired by our only friend. This is a game where you can reveal a hidden world beneath this world and it's got to have something to do with our writer's block. See how trippy that is? Jiving in Bebop with Dizzy Parker. And there's gonna be a f few of those. Yeah. Here, 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 here. How? Let me unlock you. Okay. It's not working. There's another one over here, right? Open a hole into the sky. What are you gonna reveal? Old oh, posters. Great Abe by Elvin. Oh, this isn't the past, is it? Tome one, Weird Worlds Publishing, The Great Abe. Is that Abraham Lincoln as a monkey? The Great Abe? I don't know. That one only shows up when I'm moving. There you go. Get melted open. Whoa. This is a recording studio or, uh... Um... Yeah. Some kind of operator? Radio transmission operator? How many left? One. Don? The TV's talking to you? Shh. Elf. What? What are you doing? Did you lose something? Uh, no. The TV's talking to me. Um, maybe you should get some help. Maybe you. I'm gonna give you berries now. Look at what's going on in your office, dude. Do you think I need well, help? Our illustrious writer has discovered a taste for multiple realities. It seems that way. The TV's. What do you? Maybe you should get some help. I'll go get some help. Uh, see ya. This is such a weird little game. At least so far, it's particularly trippy. Uh, it's just kind of leaving me to my own devices to find my way. It's not really directing me where to go, but that door is now open. I guarantee you there's someone to talk to. This slick-looking mofo? Or this dapper-looking mofo? Let's wander his way. The diner's open now. Lord, the whole world's open to us. Hello! Uh, hello there, young man. A novelist friend of mine told me a good story. Lay it on me. Friends gather for a dinner party. They start by having drinks. Meanwhile, in the kitchen, the host has left out a beautiful seven-pound fish ready to bake. Everyone right. gets a little tipsy, and when the woman goes back to the kitchen to put the fish in the oven, it's gone. Nothing right. but the family cat licking his chops. Where did the fish go, the guests wonder. Then they have a great idea. Why don't we weigh the cat? They all go to the bathroom, huh? put the cat on the scales, the arrow moves, seven pounds exactly. There. Now we know where the fish went, No, they say. Everyone's not. relieved to find this rational explanation for the missing fish until one of the guests exclaims... Yeah, the cat must but weigh something. where did the cat go? You could call it Schrodinger's fish, don't you think? Have a good day. Wow. I knew this would be weird. I didn't know it would be that weird. Hello? Hey, El Good to see you again. What's up, Stavros? Well, you finished your book. Didn't start the damn thing. Your tab, right? Poor Stavros is broke. The uh, police are everywhere with that crystal eight coming in from Mexico. Wow. He's away a business. The clients are too scared to buy dope from Stavros now. Oh, he's Except a dope salesman. Some guy from the narc squad came by. All in black, like a crow, a tough guy. He was like something from that TV show. The invaders, he asked about you. What? What's Elvin writing about? How does Elvin get high? He asked about Thea, too. She communist? She running with the Black Panthers? What does Stavros know? Scatter, he now knew there was a huh. communist party in America. Okay. 
And that's this guy again. I didn't tell the dude about your story. I got fired. Oh, man, I sure hope my number don't come up. No way I'm gonna get my skin full of lead. Okay, for Uncle Sam, we're in the middle of the Vietnam War. And this is a creepy-ass joint. Probably one with a TV with an Omega symbol on it, if I know what I'm talking about. Yep. And we're about to bend this reality, open tears into another space-time continuum. Five of them. Five of them. You. You're being weird. You're all, all being weird. Hello. Five of them, okay. I see... N oh, hello. Come on. I swear there was one right there. And you're new. You're, you're new and creepy. There. Open a hole. Open a hole into another reality. What do we got? A different restaurant. Yeah, there's a... There's a bar. There's a... Like a malt soda counter right up here. Um... There. F oh, get lost. There's one right here. Look, something right here. I'm getting better at this. I'm getting better at figuring it out. Whoa. Whoa. Should be down to three. Oh! It's a staircase. And it's gonna lead me... Oh! What the hell's going on up here? I need to find more of these. I need to figure out what what the hell am I uncovering? Somewhere. I just saw you light up. I saw it. Yep. Melt a hole. Expose. What? Power generators? Is this the future? Is that a Texaco symbol? It might be. One left, right? One. One left. I'm stuck now. There we go. Oh, through this back room. Gotta be in this back room somewhere, right? There. Pretty soon this is gonna start opening us up hmm, to some weird and wild you, shit. Friend. You've finally given some meaning to your life. As one of your fellow writers said, man is absurd in what he seeks, great through what he finds. I wish I knew who that was. I wish I knew. And I think that means this location's done. Who the hell are you? Green, you pencil pusher. Why are you sticking your nose in other people's business, huh? Huh. Looking for Crystal 8, maybe? I don't even know what that means. No one can get their hands on that shit. Doesn't it bother you huh. that good Americans are fighting for the free world in Vietnam while you intellectuals are safe at home, getting high around the clock? Not Three really. No. Nope. We're gonna clean up California, get rid of all the lefties, hop heads, it's homos, homos and blacks. blacks. Wow. Give it back to true Californians. No thanks. No thanks. Not interested in helping you. I am intrigued as to what Crystal 8 is. This hippie over here might know. There was talk of hippies buying drugs. What's up, girl? I see you in Monterey. You missed everything, brother. Three days of total craziness. Can you imagine thousands of brothers and sisters tripping to the sound of a sitar? Wow. Some guys never came down. Wow. Oh, try a little tenderness. He was dressed like a prince. I definitely spent the night with Jimmy and Otis. Like being right between fire and style. Wow. You should have seen Jimmy. He fucked his Stratocaster right up on stage and torched it. Oh, don't you want to light my fire, Elvin? Wow, this game is so trippy and now that sitar is playing in the background. I don't know what's next and what the hell we're supposed to be doing. Hey, can I get up in there? No, this is the end of the world. Okay. It looks endless, but it's just a street. At least for the moment. I only... Out of my way. What the hell do you think you're doing? I guess we gotta go this way. And see... What's out in this... Get off the road, you idiot. The hell's going on out here? Maybe this record shop is open now. Or the barber shop. We'll see. We'll have a look. No, record shop not open. I don't know where I'm supposed to go next. This in... There. Let's go talk to that freak face. 
There's another hippie back here. Hey, stand down. Stand down. Yeah. This game has a lot going on. Uh, hi, hip hippie. Hey, brother. It's been so long. Wow. You look like a junkie, dude. Okay. If you get any of that crystal aid, we're down. It's way better than Stavros' weed. Agreed. Say, it's some kind of chemical junk that hooks right up to a gland in your brain. Uh-huh. And sends you into a zillion dimensions. Oh, I'm on it now. Watch out, brother. There's a guy from the Narc Squad. Watch out, brother. Huh. There's a guy from the Narc Squad hanging out in the neighborhood. We saw Bea leaving your house this morning in tears. Right. Yeah, it's her karma, brother. There's a deficiency. Right, right. We're on that Crystal Lake shit right now, I think. And look. Look at this shit. Another one. Speak to me, narrator. Five, five, five. And what, out in the wilderness out here? Out in the... Where am I finding these five? The only time I've found these TVs has been in a building. Is it just around? There. I saw a flash of light, didn't I? That telephone pole is freaking the hell out. That lampshade, whatever you call it. You are so weird. You are so weird. Where the hell am I supposed to find the little omegas with the triangle? Whoa. Oh, is that me trying to get too close to the edge of the world? It might. The oaks. Oh, man. This whole thing is freaking out. The whole city's melting away and revealing some other city. Some other time? Teslaco. See, I thought that was a Texaco logo. That is a funny thing to call your electricity energy company. Look. And look, there's holes running right through into the, the old world. And I can run right through this. Opens up whole new... Can I? No, I can't go through there? I guess not, if it's if it's doing that thing to me. We just need to find more of these, more of these symbols. This is a future where the electric car is everywhere, and where we might be a successful writer, and the whole thing could be in our imagination. That's quite possible. That's weird to look at, man. This whole place is tripping me right the heck out. Hi, Stavros. Back here somewhere? Where are these symbols at? I'll go find them, guys. It feels like what we're going to be changing is whole buildings. So I gotta look for buildings that with symbols on them. I, what if the edge there? Oh, I just changed you into a car. Did I? Is that all that happened? There. Come back. I have to look away and then look at it. There. Whoa. It's like a, a firehouse, maybe? And it's melting away the whole inside of that other building, and you can see all the bits and pieces of it. This is so weird. Yeah, some sort of ambulance, police car, who knows? That light, that lamppost still going nuts? Going frickin' nuts? How many on our TV? How many symbols left? Three. We gotta find three more. I'll make you forget your fear. I'll make you forget your fear. I know you've always had a thing for pretty girls with black hair. She is putting the moves on old UTC right now. Come on, where are these other symbols at? Tell me. Show me. What's I out hiding out here? Maybe it's that lamppost. Maybe I gotta look at that lamppost, like that car over there kept disappearing, whichever one. 
Maybe I need to get close and eyeball this thing and figure out why it's freaking the hell out. Yes. Where weird things happen, glitches in the matrix appear. And I can uncover them somewhere, right? Yeah. What? Yes. Oh, it's a high rise. So strange. So strange. Okay, we need to look for more things that are glitching. Like this. I think. Yes, reveal. Reveal a glitch. Saturn record shop. It looks the same. The records just changed. Ben Miller and his orchestra. Oh, and look, there's... A great Abe, there's p things from our imaginary book. Glitch. Where are the glitches at? Show me. Oh, yep, yeah, okay. There. Oh, a whole light show opens up. What the hell is it's that? It's your lucky day, Mr. Green. We're offering you a unique opportunity to pass through the looking glass. I think I'm about to. The ultimate trip into worlds that are waiting only for you. Yep. Worlds where reality and desire are one. Holy worlds crap. Worlds where everything is possible, even oblivion. Are you ready to take the plunge into the triangle of earth, fire, and air, Mr. Green? To quote one of your peers. Reality, reality is, nothing is nothing but a point of view. Good, was that Hunter S. Thompson or something? Guys, good lord, this game is living up to my expectations and going beyond them. I don't even know what we're experiencing right now. Some weird Illuminati shit, I think. But, we're going to continue exploring the world of Californium in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching this one, and I'll come back with you with another in just a couple of days. TV, the TV, that's what's making all the noise. That's Omega? It looks like it's the end of the line for you, Mr. Green. Wow, narrator comes Curable into the game. Writer's block. A brain corroded by mind-bending drugs and dime store alcohol. Wow. The woman of your dreams and your little girl. No more than distant memories. <laughs>